Ladies and gentlemen, it's Papa Joe. Papa Joe Aviance. This is a new personal hero of mine. He has lost over 250 pounds. I've been homeless. You started this all off at 450 pounds. Yes. Broke, unemployed. You just started walking. Saw that I was able to eat healthy food from a dollar store. I love that you prove that you don't have to be wealthy to eat healthy. What I love is you're inspiring others. I want to motivate people. I talk the talk and walk the walk. All I want to do is walk. All I want to do is walk. All I want to do is walk. All right, wake up. I love this man. Okay. <laughs> I survived on $50 a week. And so can you. All right, you got $50 for the week. Make it count. Okay. I've been all across America. I've slept on couches to cots. Have a good night. I've shared beds to bunks. The reason why I stay with them is to make sure they can't cheat, they can't run. Where are you going? And they definitely can't hide. <laughs> Wait, yeah. Day three, let's go. I have to get in their face. Go walk yourself. I have to get on their ass. Come on, grab your shoes, let's go. Going inside these people's fridges, it's like watching a horror movie. <gasps> Macaroni and cheese out. Garlic mashed potato gone. Breakfast broke, girl, please. <laughs> I, I mean, I was broke, but the reason why I make them live on $50 a week is to teach them discipline and it, it, to let them know that it's mind over matter. Sometimes I have to babysit. Maddie. Thank you. Maddie. Maddie. You. Sometimes I have to referee. Who buys four bags of chips? <laughs> I gave you a budget of $50. It's you cannot. Be no. You Look. know, you're really pissing me the I off. You're pissing me off too. Let's no, go. You're... Come on, you're going way over budget. Look at this. Really? But in the end, I get the job done. Are you going to try it my way now? I guess. Oh, well, let's I go then. Come on. So far, we've got about $4 in there. Girl, put the vegetables in there. Get the squash. You grab some carrots over here. We don't stock up on vegetables because you have a $50 budget. All right, we'll get a double. But how do these cost $2? And they look don't worry like about it. They're 99 cents. I'll see you at checkout. Go on. Bye. When I'm at the register with the client, getting close, getting close. You know, I'm watching that number, that $50 to make sure that they don't go great. over. I mean, I feel like I'm at Vegas, awesome. like ding, 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 Come on, it's time to pour it out. In the toilet. Hey, how you doing? Come on in. Oh my god. How do you survive in this? You're almost a hoarder. It's like my own organized chaos. Is that what I mean? We're about to get organized right now. I teach my clients that a healthy living space is just as important as a healthy diet. We're in Burbank, California. Dave has been struggling with diabetes for some time. The sidewalk needs a treadmill. For him, weight loss could be a matter of life or death. So, uh -huh. we got it. You doing okay? Yeah. I got this. I didn't think you could spend $50, and look at what I got. It's been so fabulous. A lot of people ask me if seven days is enough to change someone's life. You know what I say? All I need is one moment. I feel electrified. There you go. I cut the negative people out of my life. You were right. Papa Joe, thank you so much for your help. I'm walking across America, changing people's lives, one house call at a time. Joe Aviance. This is a new personal hero of mine. He has lost over 250 pounds. I've been homeless. You started this all off at 450 pounds. Yes. Broke, unemployed. You just started walking. Saw that I was able to eat healthy food from a dollar store. I love that you prove that you don't have to be wealthy to eat healthy food. What I love is you're inspiring others. All right, wake up happy. Love I love this man. Okay. Oh. <laughs> help myself. Now it's time to help others. <laughs> Check me. Okay, I'm ready for bed. I've been all across America. I've slept on couches to cots. Have a good night. I've shared beds to bunks. The reason why I stay with them is to make sure they can't cheat, they can't run, and they definitely can't hide. <laughs> hey, Louis. 
Yeah! Come on, it's time to pour it out in the toilet. Come on, grab your shoes, let's go. <laughs> when I first started this journey, people thought I was crazy. I'm flying. You have to be a little crazy if you want to change the world. Yes! It's not just weight loss that I deal with. I deal with drug addiction. I want to be sober for my kids. Well, like, I, 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 I can do We got to break the cycle. People that have bullies. Is that your bully right there? Yeah. You ready to go confront him? Yes. Let's go. Depression. I just feel like I can't leave the house. Single parents, dealing with kids. <laughs> Thank you. We're in San Diego, California. Time to make a house call. Get the out of my house! I need a cigarette and I need it today. We're in Reseda, California. Get the dance! In Burbank, California, Dave has been struggling with diabetes for some time. The sidewalk is your treadmill. For him, weight loss could be a matter of life or death. House call! I have an amazing team of people that help me out. This is Maddie. She really needs some help. This is That's me on top of it. She's my little Jack Russell Pitbull Terrier. My name is Courtney, Papa Joe's executive assistant. She basically runs my life. I'll send it now, but you didn't ask me. Please. <laughs> I like an old married couple. Chef, you ready to get in the kitchen? Let's do it. I bring Chef Rice in when the client's nutrition level is just poor. <gasps> Macaroni and cheese out. Garlic mashed potatoes gone. Breakfast, br girl, please. Darren, you ready to take her to the edge? Woo! He's got a lot of energy. Darren helps my clients face their fears. All right, here we go. <laughs> Franzi is my stylist. Stop, it's Franzi. She keeps me looking good on the red carpet, and she helps my clients look good, feel good too. In order for me to understand their problems, I have to live with them. Day three, let's go. I have to get in their face. Go walk yourself. I have to get on their ass. Cindy, let's go. Franzi, Cindy hasn't been on a date in over five years. You got big booty and some butt. Emphasize your beautiful features so we can get you that second date, girl. Five, six, seven, eight, here's my number. A lot of people ask me if seven days is enough to change someone's life. You know what I say? All I need is one moment. I feel electrified. There you go. I cut the negative people out of my life. You were right. Papa Joe, thank you so much for your help. I'm walking across America, changing people's lives, one house call at a time. Ready for the next one? Yep. All right, let's go. Can you get some ice cream? No. <laughs>